Hey, what's up? It's Ryan Drake. These are the five things you need to know for December 11th, 2019. So my man ASAP Rocky, this is crazy. He's back in Sweden and he was jailed there for weeks on end, given horrible food, treated like crap. But despite the bad weather, he's having a blast with locals this time around. He took the stage today at Ericsson Globe Arena to do his thing for all the fans that he's got in Sweden. This marks the first time Rocky's been back in Sweden since he was released from custody in August during his assault trial. And he's also spending time in the slums. That's his words. He said that he wanted to go to the area known as the no-go zone to spend time with underprivileged fans. And he's true to his word because that's what he's doing. ASAP said he also wanted to go back to the prison where he was held for a month to perform for inmates. But that got shot down at the last second. I give kudos to ASAP Rocky, man. Let bygones be bygones and everything like that. It takes guts to go back to a, a place where you were held captive kind of for a while. So shout out to ASAP Rocky. So Nick Cannon puts out two diss tracks on Eminem, really? And of course, Eminem's going to clap back on all that. But man, let's think about this. Honestly, let's be true to ourselves. Nick Cannon, you're a good host. TV's your thing. But sir, rapping is not your game. The disses weren't bad. I'm going to hate to see what M does to you. So Nick Cannon, Mariah Carey, they all know this, man. It's coming. It's coming bad. And I'm already proclaiming Eminem, hands down, the winner of this one. So the SAG Award nominations are out, and the SAG Awards is right there in line with the Golden Globes for the second most important acting award. Of course, the Oscars, the Academy Awards are number one. Outstanding cast in a motion picture, well, that went to The Irishman, Bombshell, Jojo Rabbit, Parasite, and Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. All good movies, Irishman hands down should win. But here's where I'm upset. Outstanding male actor in a leading role in a motion picture, Christian Bale, Leonardo DiCaprio, Adam Driver, Taron Edgerton, and Joaquin Phoenix are your nominees. Where the hell is Al Pacino? He's in the category for outstanding male actor in a supporting role, and he is not a supporting actor. He is a guy that it all revolves around. Yeah, he's not the Irishman. I get it, but he's freaking Jimmy Hoffa in the damn movie, man. He should have been nominated for that award. I hope the Oscars don't do the same damn thing to him, because if you've listened to any of these things that I do, then you know the Irishman, by far and away the best movie I've ever seen. Read the book now and Al Pacino hands down did the best job of all of them and they all did amazing. Joe Pesci got nominated too by the way so good looking out but man put that man in the best actor award category. So New York Yankee fans are extremely happy and of course they got their guy free agent pitcher Garrett Cole and they uh, paid him a pretty big penny too. $324 million over nine years, making the price of what they're paying him nearly $1 million for every strikeout in 2019 that he got, minus about $2 million, but it's close enough. So a record-setting contract, so congratulations to Garrett Cole. He's doing what he has to do to get that money. So I got myself a ring. A lot of people got themselves a ring, and I'm talking about the security camera. Some of the stuff you capture on that bad boy is insane. So in Los Angeles, a resident's home security camera recorded the moment of a sneaky squirrel that stole a package from their front porch. It shows the pint-sized porch pirate grab an Amazon package right out the stoop in the front door and flee with all the goods. But don't worry, a resident said that they witnessed and spotted the squirrel and returned the package to the home. Sounds like a trained squirrel to me. Animals, man, they're getting smarter. We better be ready. <laughs> That's it. Those are them. The five things you need to know for December 11, 2019. I'm Ryan Drake, and we'll check back in tomorrow.